Hello guys and welcome back to Hey Manager with me Alex and today is the first game of the Premier League season. It's going to be a good one, I promise you. It's going to be very, very good. So, Liverpool away from home, our first game. Not the champions, but close to being the champions last year. We've got a very difficult game ahead of us. It's going to be exciting. I'm, going to, I'm really looking forward to actually getting into this game now. So, I know the first episode was a bit of a one. It went on a bit, didn't it? But I am going to get into this game very quickly. So, as you can see, I've, I've lined up our tactic here. We've got a second tactic to sort of bounce back onto if need be. There's a, a severe lack of uh, coverage in this central section here, which is probably what probably because four nails doesn't cover it that well. If it was to put in Craig Dawson, obviously you see it change. We've covered a lot of ground here, and I mean a lot of ground. So a lot of impact around the front, but mainly I'm just trying to support the back line to make sure we don't concede. But I, I rarely will go to that formation. For now, we've got quite a nice little side going. We've got Fabianski, Kufal, Zuma, Ogbono, Cresswell, Suchek, Rice, Bowen, Fornals, Vlasic, and Mikhail Antonio. So tactical meeting-wise, let's get into this. It says we should use Ariel instead of Fabianski, Vlasic instead of Fornals, and, well, switch them around, essentially. Opposition instructions, you always do that. Tell us to go cautious, but I am going to... I'm not going to go cautious just yet. I'm going to go balanced. I'm going to see how well this side can play just from the off, basically. Team selection, we know what we're already playing. Going to balance the 4 2 3 one we're going to go for. See how it plays out. If it's not doing too well, I will obviously change it out. But I think we can try and maybe hold our own against a very strong, and I mean a very strong, Liverpool side. So team selection is going through. Let's see how we can kick off this save. So pump up the fists. I know we're underdogs here, but let's see what we can do. I trust you to make the difference. This is this is different. The different sayings this year. Uh, hands in pockets. I trust you to make the difference. I'm not expecting anything. I think they've changed this year, so they've only got three options because it, it was a bit weird last year. We'll send the assistant to the tunnel. I need to assign that. And this is the first time I'm going to be seeing these graphics. I'll probably have to change everything. Yeah, I definitely will. Here we go. So we're going to be going this year. I want to try and use uh, TV. Let's see. How we can play. I need to turn the sounds off. I just realised I've got sounds on. There we go. Get the sounds off. Rice. So Ogbonna kicking off. And this is going to be this is going to be a nice little save, I hope. Ogbonna to Kufal. And it should, well, hopefully this isn't a key highlight from the off of them. Anyway, as we go forward, four nows. And here we are. I'm looking forward to this save because it's going to be quite an interesting way to see how we approach it in the long term. Try and figure out the team, the best team for us. They're playing Milner at left back. So essentially, what I should be doing here is doing that. <laughs> um, right, let's see how we go. Leeds are leading against Leicester 1 0. Burnley drawing Norwich, but here we have another highlight. It looks like Fabinho's playing it out to Milner. Back to Fabinho now, into Virgil van Dijk, who's trying to overlap on that wing. Fabinho now gets the ball. Henderson hits it. And Fabianski with a great save. Antonio not really doing much up front just yet. Uh, but stats wise, I think the game's going a little bit in Liverpool's favour so far. Uh, we are shooting on site as far, well, at the moment anyway, as the ball's pumped forward straight to Virgil van Dijk as the ball's been played through. Henderson's on the end of it. Can he finish? He can't. I think it hit the bar that. I'm not entirely sure. We've gone through that game incredibly fast and I don't know why. Hands on hips. Uh, you've been unlucky so far, I'm going to say to them. I think I think the defence have played pretty well. Attackers, I need to try and see something more from them. I want to see something a bit more as we're going to slow down the highlights a little bit. And, oh, Ogbon has given away what looks like a penalty, but we're going to get a VAR check. I wonder how these were this year. Checking penalty review. Penalty awarded. That's not fantastic. Ogbonna with a yellow card. Who's over it? I bet it's Salah. Is it Salah? Yeah, it's Mohamed Salah. Puts it, and Fabianski saves it. Can he? Can we get it away, though? That's the, that's the question. Thiago comes back. And we've managed to keep that out. Thank God for that. I'm flipping it. What a start. What a start. Alison Becker. We've managed to hold Liverpool so far. Matip. Coming forward now, this is a much better speed. Henderson on it. So Mohamed Salah. Oh, here we go. Matip coming forward. Gives it back to Mo Salah. Alexander Arnold's on the overlap. Back into Salah. Oh, Henderson. And we've managed to cut it out. Can we counter-attack now? Vlasic punts it forward to absolutely nobody. We might have to change up the tactic in a minute. As we've allowed Matip to just maraud through that <laughs> midfield. And nothing's happened there. What can we change up here? So, four now is having a decent enough game. Vlasic, not so much. Bonner's having a poor, poor game, but 
it's more or less Antonio. Maybe we can get if we get him playing to play in behind. If we if we pass the ball in behind, let's see if we can get anything going with that. Focus it down the wings, um, and maybe just pass it a bit more. But maybe pass it shorter. That could be the question. That could be the answer even. Um, so far, we're not we're not really getting forward that much. For now, I'm going to keep it like that. But I'll probably be bringing on Ben Rama at some point just to try and change the game up. But Milner's having an absolute blinder out on that left left back role as they've switched around the midfield. So Thiago now plays DM. They've switched it round again. I don't know what's going on. But Liverpool, 65 minutes in, nothing's really happened. Antonio, we've got no one else that can really play up front. Vlasic is having a great game. Four nows is going to come off. I'll bring in Ben Rama. I'll switch Ben Rama and Vlasic around. Uh, Chamberlain now. Salah, great tackle there. Mane's on the ball now. They're trying to find a way forward. They found Alexander-Arnold is in acres of space. Can he find a crossing? He can, and Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain follows up the deflection, and Liverpool have gone 1-0 up. <sighs> Yeah, proceed with the tactical changes, and it's a shame. It's a real shame that... Oh, I, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Um, yeah, that, that's pretty much it. It's, it's been a poor start so far. Virgil van Dijk's on it. 87th minute now. Can we maybe get something back from this game? Gomez plays it in. Can Bowen get on the ball? He can't. Chamberlain's there again. He's really caused us a few problems. Chamberlain is now... Kufal's put a foot in, and that does look like a penalty yet again. Let's see what the ref says from the VAR decision. It's a penalty. Salah will be taking it yet again. Hopefully this time he'll put... Well, I say hopefully he'll, this time he'll put it away. Hopefully he doesn't. Yeah, it's 2-0. Salah's scored. It's just a day at the office for Liverpool. A poor, poor game from West Ham here, from us. Ogbonna having an absolute shocker at the back, but Salah puts it away, tucks it away very nicely there. And that is going to be the end of the game, essentially. We've had a really poor outing here. I'm not going to lie to you. As Yarmolenko gets injured after coming on. Not great, is it? Not, not great way to start that off. Hands in pockets. We were the underdogs, but what can you say? I mean, we weren't expecting to win that at all. At all. So, we've we've started the year off pretty poorly. Trying to get anything from that game. Just didn't happen. Yarmolenko was out for four to five weeks. But it just didn't work for us. Declan Rice having a poor game out there. You know what? I might actually have to play him as a ball winning midfielder defence. That that might be the question, the answer to, for it so far. Vlasic not playing well. Jared Bowen, really poor. Let's stick him on support. And as well as that, Mikel Antonio having an absolute shocker out there. I might have to play him more as an advanced forward just so I can try and get him to run in behind. But that's pretty much it. Um, really poor out in there, really shocking. Uh, Bonner having an absolute shocker as well. Uh, Kurt Zuma doing the business really for himself. Uh, Vlasic will definitely get replaced by Ben Rama for next game. But yeah, a poor out in there for us altogether. I mean, it's not a great way to start the game, is it? Uh, Liverpool thrashing us 2-0 at home. I don't think we had that many shots or that much stats-wise. We didn't do that fantastic. I don't think it was awful. But I don't think he was fantastic. Look at that. Liverpool absolutely dominating the game. XG was very much in their favour. We just didn't do much with it when we had it. I know I should probably work the ball into the box, but nothing was generated from the game. We were just sort of sitting back hoping. I know it was on balance, but there should be more to the game than that, which is a shame. But 2-0 against Liverpool, who are a very strong side, as we know. I'll sort of take that. For an opening day of the season, we probably should have put up a bit more of a fight, but Fabianski had a pretty good game out there, to be fair. I can't really argue with that, so I'm happy he chose Fabianski. But that will obviously lead us on to the next game, which will be against Manchester United. An interesting one there. Hopefully, I get well, Ronaldo straight away. We've had Liverpool with Salah, Ronaldo at United, and I believe we've got City after that, and then Tottenham, Brighton, then Arsenal. So the fixtures aren't kind to us from the off. But then a nice run of games all the way through up until December, end of December. Uh, Chelsea in there, that would be an interesting one. But other than that, quite a difficult start for us. So I'll play that Manchester United game for myself. Then Manchester City, I will return back for episode three. So yeah, hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, please leave a like. Uh, subscribe if you're new and you're looking forward to the West Ham save. A disappointing game here overall, but... Who knows, it could be more interesting in the future. Thanks for watching, and I shall catch you in the next episode. From me, Alex, have a great day. Ciao.